I felt like it was kind of funny at times because I'm like, wow, I'm really out here like lifting a bag of charcoal, but I'm a whole college athlete. I thought Christian played very well. It's how we thought he could play since he'd been here. I think Christian's one of the top outside backers, defensive linemen in our conference. Set goals for myself of being first team all conference and really just, just being the best player I could possibly be for this defense and helping us reach our ultimate goal of making the MAC championship and winning it too. He has a, a skill trait that a lot of guys don't have. He has natural. Uh, pass rush ability. He's got high football IQ. I mean, there's times in the game on his one sack, he changes stance and knew exactly what was coming. I've gotten stronger, and then I can't really put no numbers on it, but I just I can just feel it's like a field thing. A lot of at-home workouts, just finding stuff around the house. I had the resistance band the coaches sent me. Then I had bags of charcoal. I had some uh, logs in the backyard and stuff I was using, so that helped out. The biggest thing that changed was his mindset. He realized that he can do it. He realized that he can get after the quarterback on a, on a day-in and day-out basis. I think it pissed him off that he knew he didn't play as well as he could have last year. Not that he, should, like, I don't think he deserved to be an all-conference player. I think he is an all-conference player, but he didn't deserve it last year. And at the end of the day, he's got to go out there and earn uh, those, those little uh, individual accolades. So I definitely use it as motivation, but I mean, it's, it's all good. Everything happens for a reason, so I mean, yeah, it's definitely motivation, though.